Today, we're gonna talk about tricep dips and how everybody can do them. Whether you're just starting out and you can't even do a tricep dip with your own body weight, or if you've mastered the dip and you're looking for a way to add more and more resistance. We're gonna use one simple tool. It's a 41 inch loop style resistance band from Clench Fitness. Let's jump right in. We're gonna start out, I have my dip rack set up here. It's in a squat rack. You may have a dip bar or you're a dip machine at the gym or whatever. Find two horizontal bars that you can brace yourself up in and do a tricep dip. The dip form is pretty straightforward. You're gonna get both hands on the dip bars, pick your feet off the ground. I like to cross mine a little bit to help keep stability. And then you're just gonna let yourself down as far as you can go and then back up to full extension. All right, so let's say you're just getting started and the dip that I just showed you is nearly impossible for you to do. So what we're going to do is we're gonna grab ourselves a 41 inch loop style band. I would say recommend if you are, you know, maybe 150, 200 pound person, start with the purple band. The wider a band is, the more assistance or force it's going to give you to help push you back up. So if you're a heavier individual or you have less strength, you can use a wider band and it's gonna give you more assistance. So you're gonna drape your band right between both of the dip bars so that the band kind of hangs just like this. And then when you go into this thing, you're gonna set it up so that when you jump up, you can hook in your knees to this dip bar. And then you're just gonna drop down and push yourself up. At the bottom of the rep, you're gonna notice this band is gonna give you a lot more assistance. And then as you bring yourself up, it's gonna give you less and less assistance until you get to the top locking it out. So all you need to do is customize that assistance so that you can start doing, you know, a set of 10 to 20 reps on dips. All right, so that was assisted dips. That is basically for beginners, people that are just starting out and you'll progress up through that using less and less assistance until you can master the body weight version of the dip. And then beyond that, we're gonna jump into the added resistance or the resisted dips using a 41 inch band. So to set this up, it's pretty simple. This is the way I like to do it. I've been doing it for a while and this is the most comfortable way for me. I grab my 41 inch band, I twist one side of it so that you get an X in the band. And then I bring that right over my back and I put my arms right through each side and I position that X right in the center of my back, get it nice and even, and then I grab a hold of both sides of that band. There's like two handles it forms now on the front, and that is what's going to allow you to set up your, your dip. So you grab your, make sure that X is nice and centered in the center of your back, approach your dip bar, one hand down, the other hand down, get everything nice and even and comfortable, and then you're doing dips. You're gonna notice it's gonna be a lot heavier at the top and lighter at the bottom. That's just how the band works. But it's the same form as the dip. Now you have some added resistance and you can basically use whatever band that you need to get that resistance so that you fail at the rep range that you wanna fail at. Typically we're working somewhere between eight and 15 reps to get that maximum hypertrophy and growth. And these resistance bands really help you to achieve that. All right, so those two variations of dips should apply to pretty much anybody that's no matter where you are in your fitness journey right now. And that's kind of why I wanted to put this video together today. I don't want you to be shying away from an exercise like dips or pull-ups or push-ups because, just because you physically can't do them. The goal of the whole fitness journey is to improve yourself every single day. No matter where you're starting from, where you're at, you, should, you basically wanna jump into an exercise and then find a way to progress. Or find, even if you're just starting out, find a way to start. And that's what these assisted dips 
are going to help you with. It's going to give you a way to start. You're going to get the feeling of the exercise and then you can start improving and beating what you did last week. Every single week, those little improvements are going to basically continue to compound on each other and that is how you work your way up to the, uh, the resisted versions of these dips where you've mastered your body weight and then you can progress into the big boy type strength stuff. And that's what it's all about. Like that's why we do this channel. That's why we're gonna do these videos and provide value for you. Drop us a comment below. Let us know where you're at in your dips. As always, be sure to smash that like button. If you like this content, hit the subscribe button so that you can see more of this content. And if you need bands, clunchfitness.com is the place to go and we're here to help you. So please engage with us, ask us questions. That's what we wanna see and thanks for watching.